Okay guys and girls, lords, ladies and gentlemen, and all that kind of jazz. I'm going to make a soup today, because I've had myself like a snack at tea time, and I don't really want to make a full and proper massive filling meal, but I still want to feel quite full and healthy. So I'm, I've just broken up very loosely some carrots, i got some cauliflower, almost forgot what that was called for a minute, shows you how awake I am, and of course a couple of little potatoes. The equipment I'm using, this plastic microwavable container with a vent hole in it, uh, you can turn that to seal it off, but I'm going to leave the vent open, uh, the microwave, and a very cheap mixing jug assembly thing. This I got for £5.00. Uh, in the supermarket approximately four and a half years ago, or slightly less actually. It was, it's obviously cheap rubbish made in China, but it still works after a couple of years. And I'm going to show you how to make a cheap winter, well, cheap, quick, easy, wintery soup. It tastes quite good. Now, hmm, start from the top. Let's add a splash of water. Not much, just a splash. So that when you're doing the microwaving, you got a bit of extra water rather than just the water which is in the vegetables themselves to assist with the cooking. And I'm going to shove this into the microwave for yeah, about 10 minutes. And that's going to cook a lot, make it all really, really soft. Hopefully if I've done it right. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to take all the vegetables, shove it straight into the mixing jug, mix it up with a splash of water whilst it's still hot, and then I'll just basically have my soup, that's it. Okay, you can add all kinds of stuff to it, like uh, spices or chopped onion if you got some. And it's just like, you know, it's, it's gonna do for me, I think it's gonna do for me. So, here we go. Yeah, I'm afraid this is the most, uh, you know, high tech stylish and snazzy cooking equipment and cooking video I'm going to do for you today so you're going to have to make do but on the other hand it's a way of doing soup and it's comparatively quick and easy hey guess what it's been in for 10 minutes yes really it has you can tell there's condensation on the top and there's bloody hell a load of steam coming out of it shit oh. Bear with me a second whilst I get a fork. Um, yeah, I mean, that potato's more or less done. That potato's more or less done, okay. Carrots. They seem okay as well. But do I want to, like, risk it and have slightly underdone potato? Let's just try the larger one. Hmm. I'm going to give it about two or three more minutes, maybe, just to make sure. Hey, guess what? Now it's been in for another three minutes. Yes, really. We'll just make sure it's all like nice and soft and squidgy and... Oh, fuck. Yow, shit. Oh. Okay, that's steamy. That's a lot softer. So, now we can do the fun bit. And we just put everything in here bit by bit. Okay, it's in. Splash of cold water, hopefully that'll be enough. Now I'm just going to blend it. Wonderful thing about these uh, spider leg, uh, what the hell are they call uh, camera stands, is that their shit <laughs> needs more water. That'll do. 
Now I could have used like um, gravy instead of, you know, hot gravy instead of just like water just to mix it all up, but I felt lazy today. But there you go, that's it, that's what it takes. Well, microwave, one blender, and a plastic container with a lid with a hole in it, and then basically you can make yourself some fresh vegetable soup, nice and easy. Then like there's only one more thing you got to do, I don't know whether you can see it there, but you pour it into a bowl, and you get eating it. And it tastes really, really, really good.